you know, it is kind of sad uh, for me to see those pictures. Uh, seems that this is the last family gathering before my husband gets sick. That's New, New Year's 1994, Christmas time in 1994. And Stephen graduated from medical school in 1993. And he was doing five years of orthopedic residency in Jackson Memorial Hospital in Miami. And he stayed in our condo. So my husband and I and Stella went down to visit during the holiday. I think that's a New Year's Eve. We went to one of the restaurants, have a dinner. So four of us, the family, got together. Yeah, that's the year, 1994, New Year. And then my husband got sick uh, September 1995. Now, no one's smoking now. I'm so proud of Stephen. You quit your smoker. And then he's a pick up the golfing too. You know, the young man stand beside my husband in front of St. Joe Hospital. He delivered that boy, I think, 19 years ago. So that boy, uh, the family still living in Elgin area. So he came in to the office, uh, to the hospital to pay a visit to him. I think this is uh, Stephen's uh, wedding party now. Uh, uh, are one of the part. I think it's before the wedding. That's a Dr. Schleifer and a Dr. Sun that both, uh, so you can tell. So 1969, they were partners. Uh, but they, they're still good friends uh, all these years. Uh, they cover each other. Excuse me. Unfortunately, Dr. Schleifer passed away. He was only 70 years old. And uh, I think, um, I think it's a 19, I don't, I don't remember. It's a 2000, also early year. You know, I have to say all my husband, the friends, uh, all the doctors, uh, once when they retire, no one enjoyed the retirement life. All gone short period of time. Some of them was in six months, and some of them just was one year. I don't know. They are all doctors themselves, but it seems they don't have time to take care of their own body. I remember this. Uh, at this party, I think it's before Stephen the mar uh, 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 before Stephen the wedding, our family have a dinner party somewhere. They married September nineteen ninety five in Chicago. That's uh, our family, my two brother and then my niece and then my husband. That's a tune in the wedding party. And then there's a whole group of friends uh, and uh, family member. Stella and then me. And that's my husband and then my oldest brother, Alan. I don't know. I I I, I try.
taking my husband somewhere, I don't know. So two months ago, before the wedding, that's right, just two months before the wedding, I don't know. I think Stephen, they are married since 1996. I, I don't know, since so 1995 or 1996. That's the family. This is all Stephen, the cousins. It is a 1995. That's the day after wedding. They yeah, came to our house. So that's a. In front of our garage, the cousins have a picture taken. And Stella stayed in New Mexico one year, 1995 or 1996. And I, I, can, I don't know, I can tell she skied down New Mexico. A um, couple years ago, and then my husband had a meeting in Cancun. And then he loves the golf course in Cancun because it's right on the ocean. Then he bought another timeshare. Lake Tahoe he bought in 1993, and this one he bought in 1995. Spring 1995, and he had a mild stroke in Florida, September 1995. So why? When we went to Cancun, any chance he has, he always practiced. Right, right in front of our condo, and they have an area so you can practice down there. I think he doesn't, he doesn't, he's not much about the size, so usually I like to go out to walk around and do the things, and he rather to stay home and practice his golfing. The reason he likes the, he likes uh, to buy the timeshare in the nineties. I say in the nineties is very popular. He said that when we go out on vacation, stay in the hotel, or just one room. When you go to timeshare, the resort place always have a two room and a two baths, and besides, he likes the kitchen. He wants to cook it for himself. That's a King Kong, one of the sizey area. <laughs>